Hey everyone, so welcome back to our channel and today we will be sharing with you 5 simple ways that you can get cheaper Taobao deals. So you might be wondering like Taobao is really so cheap, how is it possible to get it even cheaper? So this is for those of you all who are hardworking, you are cheaper and you don't mind putting in a little bit more effort to get like up to 10% store discount, your 8% credit card rebate and up to 10% cashback on shop back. So if you're interested to find out more, continue watching on uh, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. So let's start! Okay, so the very first method is to always look out for sales. So if you know, uh, if you're shopping on top of regularly, you know that at different period um, times of the year, they have different kind of sales like your women's day, um, your like children, children accessory day, so on and so forth. And usually during this sales period, right, they'll have a 300 minus 30 discount or 200 minus 20 discount. So basically for every 300 yuan you spend, you get $30 off, which is like 10%. So based on that, right, you are able to stack discounts so you can shop from stores that have this promo so that you can stack them on. So that means if you spend like 900 yuan, right, you get to minus 90, 90 yuan off also. So that's a good deal. So for me, I will purposely find stores that have that um, promo going on. Lah. So I'll include the image to show you, you know, what are the different sales uh, that happens during like Taobao in, throughout the year. So you can refer to that. So looking out for sales is always a good way to get, you know, your 10% off all your items. The next upcoming one as of now is 5.5 which is on 5th of May. Um, they have bigger sales like their 11.11 um, 11 sales, 12.12 12 sales, 9.9 sales. Uh, they also have like the, uh, the kids sale so that's coming up in May um, they have like their national day sale so and so forth so these are the different kind of sales that you can look out for uh, some people they wait until the big sales for example the 11 11 one to buy items because they think it's cheaper so do do your own homework you know because sometimes even the smaller sale like let's say this upcoming 551 the promotion as well as the discounts that you get is comparable than buying in at the peak period sales which might cause you know jamming uh, jam up in your shipping and all that so just something for you to know so for all these sales right you might want to do a little bit of homework so what you can do is you can add your items to cart um, and see how much the original pricing is because we've heard that sometimes during the sale right they will actually mark up the price and then give the discount that is comparable to the original non-sale price so it's just something for you to take note um, you know when you're buying your items especially the bigger ticketed items okay so the next thing is having cash back so as most of y'all know we've mentioned in some previous videos how i use shop back so a shop back that's up to 10 percent off i don't really know the details of it but um there's a video that we will link so that you can go and watch how i use the shop back um, but shop back is great it's really convenient uh, and I mean we get a few cents here and there, it adds up to one dollar, you know that kind of thing So why not? It's free money, so that's one um, Secondly is to have your credit card rebates uh, As most of us might know there are like two kinds So one is your cashback rebates, second is your mouse card So for Chris and I, we actually decided to go with the cashback rebate So when we went on Money Smart to look for credit cards that might be suitable, we found two So one is the POSB everyday card that gives you 8% on like online shopping so that includes Taobao, Lazada and Shopee as well um, the other card is your friend credit card so friend gives you 6% uh, for online spending so these two um, yeah we use them and we thought that it's quite good for us Taobao people and for mouse people who are looking for points and to exchange them into flying mouse right so uh, you can go to Money Smart to check them out also but we do know that there are some cards right that give you extra points or extra miles for like overseas current overseas currency spending so if you pay roaming pay you know they give you like maybe instead of one for one point it's like 10 times more or something yeah so do check out the link to money smart down below we are not sponsored it's no referral link um so all the details like minimum spend all that you can check it out there as well okay and the next thing that a lot of all these online shopping places are doing is having in-app games so Taobao has a few in-app games um, and there's one in particular where you collect coins, you do some small tasks to earn coins that can offset your purchases. So for me, I what I did right, I actually installed the widget on my iPhone home screen. 
uh, it actually gives me extra 10 coins <laughs> so I mean it doesn't cost money now so I just do it every day I just click in to collect the coins I do the tasks so and so forth uh, if I miss it, it's okay But these coins, I mean it's free They kind of make you go back into the app Which is what Taobao wants you to do But I mean if it gives me free money to offset, why not right? So yeah, you can be diligent in your coin collecting You know, you can add each other as friends um, To send each other coins To help each other and so on and so forth So yeah, if you like us to do a video on like Taobao in games Let us know So that maybe you can introduce to y'all You know, what are the different games and what it does Okay, so the next thing that you can do is to buy in larger quantities. So this can be through group buy or you know asking your friends whether anyone want to uh, chip in with you. So for example, last time when we bought placemats in large quantities, right? Uh, we actually I actually spoke to the seller and asked whether they could give us a wholesale price. So they were willing to give because we had large quantities. So this is something that you can look out for. Uh, whether you are able to buy in a larger quantity or whether you are able to meet it to get it at a lower unit price. Okay, and last but not least is using a third party folder. So using a third party folder is honestly to me the most cost efficient um, shipping method, especially if you are buying large bulky items um, like your furniture, your appliances and all that. Lah. I mean if you are just buying clothes, your usual everyday accessories, right? Small small things, then I don't recommend using a third party folder because it's not as cost efficient. Lah. You can just use Thai now. Um, which we have a video for that as well so yeah if you are interested in finding out how to use a third party for the um, and why is it cost efficient you can check out our other videos but essentially you know if you are really paying so much for furniture or Taobao um, then if you are able to save more why not right so yeah third party folder is a lifesaver because you can ship all kinds of things that Thai Niao don't let you do you can ship your fragile mirrors you can ship your appliances your electronics so and so forth so yes Okay, so I hope these five ways um, will help you be able to get, you know, cheaper Taobao deals. I mean, it's a bit of extra work. You can't just like click, click, click and then check out. Um, but I mean, that's the way we get cashback rebates lah. So if you're interested in us doing a video, you know, on like maybe which credit card we will recommend, doing a comparison on cards like for example, Utrip, um, you know, let us know and then we will maybe consider doing one lah. So thank you for watching our video and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!